What's going on everybody? Gundam Flexing here. I'm going to show you all that I've been farming since the last episode. I've been farming a lot. And I've actually beat the final boss and I've even played survival. I mean just look at the top left. I have 94 grand, right? I'm level 15. So I've been farming a lot trying to get all these rare weapons for this game. But I beat the boss. I got silver on my first attempt and I've tried maybe... I, I've probably beat the boss up to 20 times, I'm not gonna lie. I just repeatedly kept spamming him with weapons, but I can never get gold until just like maybe uh, an hour ago or so that I found the strategy I liked and I abused it to no end and I got gold. And that like guy as I said over here, what is this? What is what is he doing? This is my right click. I, I think his salute is broken. <laughs> All right, but look at this. I even attempted one Ready survival to get back out there. the 21 waves, Good. but let's go to Mars, right? Welcome I think back. we left off somewhere up here. And as you see, I didn't do so hard. This, this level is actually source. quite hard. This level is uh, quite difficult as well. You start here, we'll you progress the there. Uh, and then of course you got the cathedral we level, which I'm going to show you. Uh, I'm not going to upload the, any other episodes nightmare. aside from this final attempt to show you I could get gold on the final boss simply because this game got very repetitive. After farming for so much just to buy, just to buy stuff on the shop, yeah, uh, I got I got a little bit bored. It got extremely repetitive. Same enemies, uh, same concept, just waves and waves and waves. But as a courtesy conclusion for Iron Brigade, I'm going to get gold again on the final boss, which is disappointing because uh, he's not a giant bear like he, you imagined him in the little previews on the screens. He's not a giant bear. He's just a giant house, a giant uh, sar looking house. But the strategy to beat him is just to outfit yourself with all these shotguns, right? And the top left shotgun is the most powerful shotgun. Unfortunately, you can only get that from one level, which takes like 20 minutes to beat. And uh, again, it just got it's so repetitive that I just couldn't do it. But the layout I have here is strong enough to be able to beat him within a couple seconds of gold. Uh, so again, we're going to do this procedural. We've made it to and as a final fortress. courtesy to end this series, I'm going Let's to do one last mission. Here we go. Well, to my new home, Frank. Vlad, once again, you've gone too far. He's gone too far, guys. Caused, the homes you've my destroyed, phone is up. the lives you've taken. It all ends now. It all ends now, guys. Fight, Dude, you guys won't believe how, how much I farm this guy. Uh, pretty much. All you do is you run up to him. With him. Take him out. And... And then you entrench yourself with the fast load weapons and you just go and, and bottom right will tell you his health levels as you can tell it's dramatically falling. After, after every cutscene your uh, your little mech is untrenched so you have to trench him back. So here it is, okay. He's going to transfer him into an uglier house and quickly entrench yourself again. And you just blast him at close range. Whatever kind of warp signal Vlad just keep blasting at close range, close range, keep blasting at close range. He'll, he'll transfer one more time, and that's when you can do damage to his red. Okay, and now this is the final transformation. We're going to lay down one anti air trench, and we're going to entrench ourselves again. So one emplacement and entrench ourselves. Uh, actually, I don't think we need to entrench or uh, lay an emplacement, guys. We should be able to, because we're so close to range, we should be able to kill him before we die. So we quickly entrench ourselves again, and just go ham again. We just keep spamming. Probably hear my mouse go off. There it is, uh, minute 17. We have about 15 seconds at minute 20. Is it possible to do this? Yes. You guys don't understand how, how many times I've attempted this, uh, especially with machine guns. I thought the machine gun was the answer, since Looks it was like uh, the answer for every other box. Permanently. Yeah, the bear is hibernation permanently. And let's see. Boom, gold at 83 seconds. So that's the trick guys, and in the last video I was probably level 13, just to get the 15 took a lot, took a lot. And I got a ton of cash, got a bunch of, I got extra, a lot of loot guys, a lot of these super rare loots, the one with the red outlines. Uh, so I already have this, 
I don't think I have this. The great grandfather of all cannons. <laughs> Uh, don't really use any of the cannons. I even tried the, the uh, artillery cannon method and it's just too slow. So shotguns point blank, shoot him in the face, literally, because I think the house is his face. Uh, at least his final formation was his face. And uh, that's it. This concludes... The cathedral fell, this and so did Vlad's series. unholy church. We put his pet bear out of its misery and silenced the broadcast again. We return to a world that was tired of turmoil. A world that was ready for a fresh start. Ready for peace. So we did our best to settle into the quiet life. And for the time being, the broadcast was nowhere to be heard. Except in our nightmares. Our oh, nightmares. And there we go, guys. Here's just the roll credits. But that is how I beat Iron Brigade, the final boss, at gold. Remember, you don't have to have the mega super awesome shotgun. Uh, I'll show it to you real quick. You don't have to max out on that, because believe it or not, it only takes up one slot. Let's go real quick. I think this is a good conclusion for the game. This one right here, it's sawed off 264 versus 170, blah, 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 blah. But yeah, out of some courtesy, I just wanted to show you all um, how to beat the boss and I could get gold on him. And uh, I didn't show the other levels on Mars simply because, again, it just got super repetitive and I just didn't want to um, discontinue that trend of just waves after waves. So I went ahead, finished the levels, beat the boss uh, at least at least 20 times um, with different various combinations. Got silver, finally got gold when I switched to shotguns. That's it. Whew, it's been a crazy game. It was. It, I like the first couple levels, um, like Pacific, Europe, and Africa. Then after that, I, I think the game just dragged on way, way too long. This game is definitely designed for those, uh, for the radio room, for those who have friends. Yeah, for those who have friends, <laughs> um, to invite and play. Other than that, it gets it gets so so repetitive by Mars. It's just waves after waves, and it's just a mind-boggling mess. So. But that's it for Iron Brigade, guys. Appreciate y'all for watching. Keep your eyes out for the next video game, next series. I'm not really sure because Steam has so many good sales, and there are a couple mech games I want to try. But uh, we'll see what game I'm going to hit up next. Again, thank you all for watching. This is his Martian salute. Thank you all for watching, and I salute you all. And I will see you all next time. Peace out.